Welcome back everyone to episode 74 of our Let's Play to Reform the Taiyi Sect. Uh, let's see. I think we got everyone set up here. Nothing very interesting going on here. There's uh, some evil people out there in the world, but nothing's new. <laughs> the earthquake is still going on. Uh, looks like it's going to be done tonight. Uh, speaking of which, let's see if we can uh, hire some talent. Uh, or anguish soul gems, one of the two. <laughs> okay, Bing, Bing Toe here is... <laughs> I'm going to make fun of this name a lot. <laughs> She's pretty good, though. Luck is five. I kind of prefer to see luck at six. This isn't terrible. She could probably be like a uh, water cultivator in training or something like that. Her constitution is her lowest point, though. take her in for now. We can always tell her to become an anguish soul gem if we don't want her. <laughs> we had decent stats though. Okay. Oh, that's right, we need to look for miners too. So I don't, I don't know what happened to that previous event. We had one... Uh, we were going to try to mine up some holy stone, and we really want to do that, uh, obviously. <laughs> but, um, I don't know if we just, if, if, if it failed, it probably failed, because we didn't get anything. <laughs> so, that answers that question, but why it failed is the, uh, the bigger question. And I would guess it would be because of, um... Just insufficient mining capabilities. 21 mining, 30 mining. Yeah, I don't care if you're ugly. <laughs> so it's central plain. Yep. 30 mining, central plain. <laughs> okay. Uh, the rest of you, though, you can all uh, help out the sect as well. <laughs> Anything interesting over here? Dang, our cheese sense is kind of low. Unfortunately. Strong, sensitive warrior. <laughs> also sounds like an anime character. <laughs> okay, do we have any miners? 20-something in mining. It looks like it's really tough to get anyone in the 30s. Uh, let alone 40s. But farming, as you can see here, we, we get uh, people in the 50s all the time. 60s and whatnot. There's a 38. Should be fine for now. We'll see what happens the next time we choose uh, stones on that. If that fails, we'll uh, have to try other options. I'll do one more round, I think. Oh gosh, <laughs> these poor souls. Um, <laughs> if only this was higher. This guy could be a battling miner, though. <laughs> I 
sure go over there. <laughs> Alright. Should be good for now. Oh, we don't want to hit four of them, because last time we did that, a lot of them were just standing outside here. Okay, people are, uh, people are bored. It's never a good sign. <laughs> So what we can do, since our outers are bored, uh, we can, uh, another fun mechanic that you can uh, take advantage of in this game is the uh, laxatives. <laughs> Just make a few of them. <laughs> it does use a bit of frost powder and a bit of herb, but uh, they're pretty cheap to make for the most part. Well, they are able to, to do this, right? So Yi Yingji should make them when she's done uh, cooking, uh, but she is not. Okay, there she goes. Is it because she can't haul things? No, she can. She's just being a goof. Okay. <laughs> So we've got a bit of laxatives now. <laughs> Can be used to treat symptoms such as bloating and dirt eating. Uh, the user will feel extra weak after they're done. But there's another advantage as well. <laughs> okay, what is this? Con plus 20%? well, that's huge. We're going to put that right here. Uh, let's put these against the wall. Because I don't want to look down here anyway. Collect resources. Speed up the game a bit, too. Let some time pass. Gujun's cultivation had progressed. Good. Let's sort this uh, talisman out of here. Thought I already clicked that, but. Okay, let's move this. Uh... Move it down here. Bunch of people died, but it doesn't matter to us. <laughs> 57,000 people. It's almost at 200k. So we'll keep doing charity. Yep, power's looking good. We're getting 125 uh, influence a day. So we're actually starting to, um, to pool a lot of it here. <laughs> you want to play with it, huh? Don't play with the toys. Doesn't change your bless or curse rating, so... <laughs> Don't mess around with it. 
kind of surprised that one doesn't. You'd think playing with toys would be a, uh, perhaps a mischievous thing. Okay, Woodshang, uh, you need to go back to practicing. So Leo, without even really trying, got up to 200 on her inner cauldron. So this is a pretty good sign. It means that things are going pretty well in our sect. What's her cultivation speed at? Yeah, 720% on June 1 right now. We're going to have her eat a uh, fixing pill. A uh, fixing pill, all it does is it locks the character's uh, appearance. In case you couldn't tell, uh, I'm actually referring to a character. <laughs> Wait. Yeah, June 1, yep. Some of you might even know the character, perhaps. All right. Gujun's not getting us a lot of the uh, the stuff we want. They want a holy stone. Um, normally we would want to keep these, obviously, but we are starting to get some in. We have seven sitting around. And this is one of the few ways that we can actually get connection without using a spirit root. And that's two. So we are actually going to use this. Um, yeah, <laughs> that's the best way to explain it. We can, it's not easy to get them, but we can get them in a, at a regular interval. And um, yeah, it's hard to pass up on connection. <laughs> so we'll do that. Uh, these guys, actually, we have six connection with them. Ah, but uh, we haven't quite reached respect with them yet. That's unfortunate. Because we would definitely want to buy a Phoenix or Dragon Elixir from them. Uh, but eventually, eventually we will. Uh, what is our relationship with them? Okay, so maybe in about 150 more, uh, reputation will be good. Still have a polar night for four days, so we won't even bother feeding them for now. <laughs> okay, immediately replaced it. Yeah, this is a huge decrease to con right here, so that's good. And there's technically no limit to the amount of suppression we can do, I'm, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure all of this stacks. So, um... <laughs> the closer we get to everyone being at zero, the better. Uh, as we get down there, we'll have to keep in mind, like, what the name of the person is. <laughs> so we don't... Uh, like, I think this is the person. As you can see, their stats are slightly modified right now. Uh, <laughs> the con is at 2.8. Uh, Bing, Bing Togu. Slingshot Master and Prodigal Son. She's alright. Yeah, she's she, she's just kind of so-so, right? We'll keep her for now, though. The rest of them can become uh, food for the sect. What's wrong with her? Frostbite. Yeah, I was going to say, go ahead and equip... Um... Oh, we don't have any good stuff, do we? Oh, that's right, we sold it all. Let's make some. OK, 
Okay, so we have uh, the laxative now. <laughs> what room are you guys in that it's so cold? Surely you're not walking in there. This room is pretty cold, I guess. Why is that, though? Really shouldn't be that cold. Oh, it's negative 29 degrees period outside. Okay, <laughs> that explains a bit. <laughs> Alright. Fair. <laughs> So let's see, what kind of goals do we have right now? Uh, Emily can uh, can become stronger in a lot of ways. We'll have her gain protection for now. Okay, there's an ancient cultivator out there. Let Emily go take a look as well. Okay. <laughs> and as you can see, there are some extra fertilizers out on the field now. Phoenix wood. Perfect. Good, so this should give them things to do now. <laughs> There's no excuses for not working hard around here. That game we could probably get away with just having... Um... <laughs> there we go. That's what we're looking for. Uh, that game we could probably get away with having um, maybe like four or five outers. They'll just have to be really specialized, you know? Highly capable outers. Okay. The equivalent swordswoman. <laughs> equivalent to what, though? <laughs> okay. That could be bad or good, depending. <laughs> do have the other worm. I had June uh, eat one of them, I think. Yeah, the winter worm. And it is 100%, so you can only eat one. So where's the other one? There it is. I vaguely recall that you need to... Um, you need to eat one of each on a character to accomplish one of the quests. 
probably some kind of uh, resistance talisman or resistance Stella or something out there in the world. So mo most of the weird Stellas that you see out on the maps, the various maps, they all have like some condition. If you're able to meet, um, you get a reward. Okay, this looks good. This looks like a lot of anguish soul gems. Uh, Balan, we haven't touched you in a while. How are you doing, man? We're looking for the cursed Feng Shui essence. Okay, we have 500. Really like to get this up to at least over a thousand, I'm pretty sure. Where I'd feel comfortable with uh, flipping this room on its on its head. The one thing that we can do pretty easily is just knock out this door and put a wall in. That'll help. And we'll just have to fix the uh, elemental alignment of things in here. Oh, no, we don't need to fight for it. <laughs> we don't care about a random artifact that much. Ancient artifact is about to be unearthed there, yeah. thought it was like a book or something. I guess I should have looked more closely at it. So we are all done with this, right? Yes. All Phoenix wood. All the time. So we will chop this Phoenix wood. Rabbit learned there were gems. Yeah, that's right. We got the, uh, the really cool. I don't even think I've ever seen a phoenix mantle feather in my life, so. <laughs> yes, yeah, some of these guys are pretty tough. Way wrong, it's your turn. These two are unconscious. Oh, this is a golden core. We don't want that. Um, it's a golden core too, but she can equip three artifacts. Uh, she can also ascend, although it might be somewhat difficult for her. Is her wall interesting? She's definitely a spellcaster. Hmm. 20 of 30. Jeez. It's crazy how they can... How these random characters can just have, uh... So much more. Uh, let's see. Oh, she's learned Soul Inquiry. Hmm. Um, not really useful to us. It'd be nice if she'd learned Greater Possession, but that's Primordial Spirit anyway. Um, do we want her... I think it's probably probably not a good thing to bother with these people unless they're primordial spirit, really. Yeah. I can't really think of any good use for her for now, so 
We'll just have um, the fox take care of them. We'll only look at primordial spirits in the future then. So yeah, he needs to do the reincarnation ASAP. Still frostbitten. This room is only negative five, though. <laughs> nice brisk temperature for sleeping. Should start to warm up here soon. The problem is it's also a... The polar night is still here, so it's cold. What is she doing over here, anyway? Just reading in the outer disciples room? <laughs> Sometimes I wonder about my, uh, my disciples. <laughs> New specter refinement after their, uh, she's done with that. the uh, demons out. It's an exorcism. <laughs> Why is her mood so poor? Listless. Oh yeah. She did the spirit splitting. So she gets that mood debuff the whole time. Slightly increases artifact here. Okay. So we'll look at uh, Craftina. Uh, whenever I, I tell her to come back, that is. <laughs> For now, she will be a gopher. We are starting to get some Cinnabar in, too. Perfect. So Zhang, I think, oh yeah, okay, so she does need to learn a bunch of stuff, so I was going to say, it didn't look like she had a lot going on here. You don't have to worry about they, they won't interrupt their breakthrough so you don't have to worry about you can it, it'll just queue it as you can see here so um yeah so she'll learn all of this stuff she has plenty of uh plenty of uh inspiration to learn everything I think to get the Golden Core uh, manuals, you pretty you pretty much only need like a million or so total. Maybe even less, actually, now that I think about it. We'll also have her study the... Um, just make sure she has the attainment manual. Oh, is that Golden Core? Okay, I guess it's Golden Core requirement. Okay. For some reason, I thought it was core shaping. Gotcha. Okay, so let's decrease the uh, size of this again.
The working area is blocked. What? Because there's a tree growing here? <laughs> okay, I didn't know that. So... Let's put a flooring down there for you. <laughs> I guess. Uh, the other thing that we could do, these are feng shui buildings as well. Uh, so we could actually um, tear these down and make them like uh, out of regular materials. Uh, and then make, make sure that they uh, match feng shui wise. That would definitely improve our rating too. This water vat is still a problem though, interestingly. Oh, okay, yeah, because the flooring is spirit wood, but it should be... Is crystal offcut. It should be water to feed the wood. So we'll see if that fixes it. it you know, seeing stuff like that, it's like, come on, man. <laughs> it makes me just want to look at everything and see what I've done wrong, you know? <laughs> I'm sure there's... Plenty of other things that have uh, stood out to people. <laughs> it just makes you wonder what it is, you know? What's going on in this sect that you just... Your eyes glance over repeatedly until you spot it. Yeah, I think all the cultivation rooms are perfect. I think it, this room is problematic. Although it looks perfect now. Yeah, never mind. Um, let's get rid of this for now. We're not using it anyway. We might even tear down this whole room, to be honest. Uh, I'm trying to think of what would what would look good here. Has to be a one tile thing. Be some vases. Do that for now and see what that does. Uh, yeah, we have jade flooring all the way throughout, so. And there's a tiger. Let's see if our hunter can take care of it. We should probably also give the chi shield to the hunter next. Whoever that is. Oh, yeah, we never set uh, Bing. What do we want to have her do, anyway? I'm actually not even really sure, to be honest. Could have her follow. Um... <laughs> yeah, I, I, I don't know. She's experienced at magic crafting. Kind of don't really need a magic crafter right now. Put her here for now, uh, and then we'll send this guy to be a disciple when he comes back, or a, a, a spirit, or an, an English soldier. I mean, <laughs> one of the two. Okay. Jim one found a pain tolerance and farming speed talisman. 
farming speed is pretty nice. Wrong Ann could use that. Kang should be doing that first. Yeah, he's in battle right now. Okay, there he goes. So he's attacking our uh, Lumina Quark Chi Cushion. He just got a small cut. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that was epic. <laughs> Okay, this one might be a little bit more involved. Really? These are elders? Kinda wanna invade the Pit of Doom right now, jeez. Is that the best you've got? <laughs> Uh, send in a couple more for good measure. Just to make sure we don't have any mishaps. Remember the no dying policy. <laughs> Alright. Are you guys actually. <laughs> I don't think you are, but. You only have 39,000 chi. What's wrong, buddy? Why are you an elder? <laughs> So that's 200,000, though. Uh, he can't digivolve. <laughs> so. Um, he can meditate, which is cool. He can do thunderstorms. Uh, which is also cool, I suppose. Um. Oh, he's dead. Oops. I thought he was alive still. Ah, this one's still unconscious. Okay. Alright. Kill all these people, please. Okay. Looks like we've got a lot of anguish soul gems here as well. and fertilizer. Okay, we'll speed up the game a bit more. I think we'll have to remember Kiang is the, the next guy to get uh, a set of uh, outer tools. We'll do that when uh, we'll tell Craftina to come back and do that. Yeah. Okay, Shang is learning things. Actually, looks like she's done now. Would Chang tend to teach teach more? Oh, that's right. We wanted to learn what um, what her stats were. So she needs luck, int, and charisma. Uh, let's see. That's it. So after that's done, uh, we'll see what she has on the, the docket for learning. We'll eat, uh, let's see, we'll eat a ginseng and ganoderma.
Uh, you're pretty much done. Uh, the other thing that I've been forgetting a lot. Uh, we need to specter to find more of these things, too. The other thing I've been forgetting to do on all of our cultivators so far is uh, junk pills. I'm pretty sure we picked up some. Yeah, we have 13 right here. Um, I think... I'm not 100% sure, but I'm not sure if you would gain a benefit from making these T12 or not. I think we're going to do it anyway. But I might have to look into that a little bit more. Uh, the other uh, mod that I've always considered is a mod that actually tells you, like when you mouse over the item, what the effect of the item is, and it also tells you what the effect is at tier 12. So that's a very nice mod. Uh, I can't remember what it's called exactly. That's probably a mod we'll maybe uh, consider installing in the future here too. Because uh, to be honest, you know, I, I don't... Uh, I guess I'm the type of player that doesn't like uh, things to be made too easy for me. I just like to remove, like, overly tedious things, number one. Uh, and then number two, um, like, if information should be known, I believe, at least I believe that, that it should be known, <laughs> then I don't see why the game should, should not give me that information. Um, so, stuff like that would be how much chi is on a tile, for instance. And I think there's one called More Grid Info, which will actually tell you, uh, in addition to all the regular stats down here, it'll actually tell you how much chi is on a tile. And I don't understand why that's not part of the game by default. You know what I mean? That's like a critical piece of information that influences how, you know, your cultivators develop. So... It seems rather unusual to leave that out. Anyway, uh, Liu, Zhi, uh, Liu Zhizhen is st <laughs> sitting at 21k. About June. Uh, June. Oh, June hasn't eaten a uh, Earth Flux yet, so we'll fix that. Oh, wait. Okay, almost killed her. <laughs> Palm of Absorption. I just canceled it a palm, palm of absorption. Let's try that again. Okay. Yeah, we'll try to preach over them. It's a good way to make friends. She's dancing, indicating that she's done. Double check. Yep. And then she should be able to eat the second one, no problem, even if there's a bit of chi in it. Her chi reserve will be so much higher, so. A vessel has died. Uh, let's see. Okay, these people have gone out again, and I didn't want them to. So we'll send Gujun and Craftina back to sort out things in the sect. Uh, Jun, are you able to learn anything from, uh... No, you've already got everything. I think you guys are pretty much done. 
Yeah, it's kind of weird, isn't it? I feel like uh, Junwan is missing something. Junwan should be way better, I think. Her cheese sense right now is 92. Oh, hers is 104. So that might, might explain part of the difference, but I think there's something else here. Oh, Liu also had a winter worm. Okay. Well, we can eat more of these, but that's not going to do a whole lot. So we'll take care of this event with uh, Craftina. Can play with the, the fox, it's fine. Uh, we will do a spiritual breath to get this going. working on overtime right now. Uh, and then we'll also... Where we? Oh yeah, Kujun was going to do an insolment. And uh, we'll also have him help out a little bit. I think do one round of spiritual breath chant and then The Exultant Sect is visiting us. Fire person. Uh, we'll kick out C2Shi. Because we don't really care about him, to be honest. <laughs> Q. Yeah, you are fire, right? Yeah. And you are definitely part of an evil sect as well, so that, all that makes sense. Uh, <laughs> Let's talk to you with uh, Social Hui. So you two can do a spiritual breath chant. Oh, all the spots are taken. Uh, just do it here, it's fine. Okay, this guy is naive. So uh, we could actually uh, move him all the way up to 100, which is uh, what we'll do. Make sure he sends back to his sect that uh, this place is actually great. Uh, five stars on Yelp. <laughs> Yeah, I know something about him. <laughs> there we go. Uh, tell me about yourself. Okay, you like rubbish, cotton, wood, and meat. <laughs> but not spirit wood. We only like the, fun, the, the simple things in life. <laughs> and, uh, of course, um, if you chop it up, it's great. <laughs> These guys are goofy. All right. <laughs> and the other thing that we'll do, uh, as usual, is panacea. See, actually, he's actually taking <laughs> these guys. Uh, I don't think he'd like it right there, to be honest. It's intense chi. Yeah, it's in disarray. So it's not exactly a good spot. Um, yeah. 
We'll help you, help you along. See if we can learn any mental state boosters. Um, they're kind of all expensive, aren't they? Greatly increases artifact power. We'll do that, actually. The one thing I kind of forgot is you also want to make sure that you ascend one of your alchemists. So we might do that with Liu here. We probably want to ascend like one of each too. Uh, there, there's a reason. Uh, we'll talk about it when we get it done. <laughs> How about that? Uh, I don't think we need constitution or perception on this character. I think Junwan's good on... No, uh, she does actually need constitution and perception. Maybe we'll just do the constitution, though. Constitution perception do uh, influence Max Chi as well. So something to keep in mind. Or, uh, Constitution, I think, and Intelligence does. Perception, I think, might, to some extent. Okay. So let's get this, uh, Spectre Refining going. Need to get these Junk Pills done ASAP. Gujun's still sucking up the Chi. Uh, he can do it better. Right here. Okay, he's gonna go to sleep. <laughs> Alright. Good. Alright, so we'll have, uh... Liu eat the first one. Yeah, so it, it even tells you here, uh, it's absor absorbed too much of the alchemy furnace's fire. Uh, consuming it will cause one's uh, five visceras to burn. <laughs> but there might be something to gain out of it. Yeah, you can eat wheat. Uh, so immediately she falls unconscious. Uh, she's near, near death. <laughs> she has a visceral burn. She becomes completely corrupted in a couple days. So she can't move at all right now. Oh, but she gained some max G. <laughs> Let's fix her up. Just make sure, obviously, when you do this, that you have someone around. Looks like someone's gonna collect her and put her in bed. <laughs> Just make sure you have someone uh, capable of doing panacea, or you can use, like, a fire pill or... Um, What's the one? Not spirit powder, heal powder, I think it's called. That's a pretty cheap way of uh, sorting it out, too. The absolute cheapest is, of course... Oh, darn. Okay. Cheapest, of course, is Panacea. <laughs> so. She's near death, and now she's gonna be fixed. So it's almost Junwan's Jun turn now, too. <laughs> Spectre refinement. Uh, 
Why is the spiritual breath happening slower right there? What? Oh, there it is. A thousand. There we go. <laughs> I'd say that should work a lot better than what we were doing in the past. Okay. Let's try to get that done now. We'll have June 1 figured out. It'd be nice if the, if, uh, the Tier 9 version of the pill was the same as T12. But um, not 100% sure on that. And by the way, just so that you know, there I think I've mentioned in the past, there are blue ones and purple ones that appear naturally. Only the purple ones, the naturally purple ones, are useful. You cannot raise a blue one up to, you know, purple quality. Uh, for it to be useful. They are two different items entirely. So they're both called junk pills, but only one of them <laughs> actually does anything useful. Okay, the fire spirit root uh, is now more cursed than ever. Uh, okay, we no longer have... Um, No longer have a polar night. So let's uh, feed it. Purity leaf is fine. And this thing can eat a. What were we feeding? We were feeding like stone essence or something, right? Yeah, let's do that. up you can go uh, practice uh, you can go practice again uh, probably maybe that'll be the last time or something uh, we'll have you wait are you trying to say you still failed to get it oh man okay one more uh, spiritual breath chant then Second time that's happened today. Come on. <laughs> It'd be nice if they just, you know, did it. <laughs> if they're just if they're just having fun, you know what I mean? Just go and do it. <laughs> Maybe there's a mod for all that too. <laughs> Probably. So we'll have uh, Zhang go and practice down here. Do May. She's got a divine gift. She's actually pretty impressive. For the uh, save for the fact that she's 280. Battle and cheat sense are too low. I was gonna say maybe we um, maybe we do a, a reverie rebirth on her, but her law is abysmal too. So yeah, she's not that interesting to us. A fire guard and white tiger. Uh, she too needs a fire bed. She didn't want us sleeping right there though. Hmm. Um, I guess we just have a lot of fire people. Let's 
see. We could sleep in a wood bed, I think. Not 100% sure on that, though. Okay, we don't have any wood beds anyway. <laughs> Let's try a uh, metal one and see what this does. Fire destroys metal, but then again, that shouldn't matter, I would think. So, do may. We need to do a uh, panacea on her. And I think we need to expand. We need to finally expand this. So this might be what we do next uh, episode. Uh, move uh, this library further to the west. And then maybe down. And then, and then cut off this part of it. And then expand this to the west as well. So where is this guy? Because <laughs> this is getting kind of ridiculous. <laughs> Just to make sure he doesn't have any afflictions, right? Okay, that'll be cured in no time. Okay, there we go. Should be good. Alright, uh, this too should be good. So let's do Spectre Refinement, and then cancel the Breath Chant. Oh man, she's in a complete breakdown. <laughs> it's fine. Uh, what? Uh, how much XP does she have now that I think about it? Where is she at in the list? Oh, she's up here now. Um, inspiration. Okay, I think she needs... What was it, like... 4 or 5k more? So that's not bad. She's getting it pretty quick. She's going to be disabled for a bit, unfortunately. <laughs> okay, this is done. Jin Wan, go ahead and eat it. It won't hurt at all, I swear. Okay, you shouldn't have believed me. <laughs> uh, the other thing we have to do is we have to re-equip weapons, too. For some reason, uh, they don't drop their artifact, but they do drop their weapon. Uh, take it up with the game, not me. <laughs> I couldn't tell you why. One of life's greatest mysteries. Okay, so she's getting a hold over here. Okay, I don't think I've ever seen them just recover on their own. That was interesting, but all right. Okay. Yeah, and so you can only take one of them per life, so. Okay, we'll have Junwan learn more constitution stuff. Not that one, though. <laughs> I think this is about as good as these guys get. So we'll do one more round of uh, practice uh, before they uh, go into mind suspension. can go and cultivate instead, please. <laughs> you can sleep later. Okay, let's do this uh, spirit or specter refining. And then we'll send uh, Gujun back out. Craftina. Uh, 
think we were going to craft a yeah, big day, so we need a bit more chi for that. There's something else I was going to do with her, right, I think? I feel like there was something else I was going to do with Craftina. Oh, she's completely out of stamina. So we'll eat. One of those and all of those. Yeah, we only had 26 days of these left anyway, so. Yeah, they restore 100 stamina each, so that's pretty good. Perfect. Okay, and we get to fire missiles, too. <laughs> I can think of no better way to uh, <laughs> close the episode out. Although I'm not sure if it's even been an hour. Hmm, has it? Who knows? Fires and missiles. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's see... Uh, Jing, um, Jing, Jing's gonna equip the next, uh, firecracker, because we're gonna have her stay around, I think, now. So there. Get a slightly better chance. Uh, speaking of the firecracker stuff... Okay. <laughs> Wait, okay, there. All right. So yeah, I think that is a pretty decent spot. Um, let's look to wrap things up. Ooh, check that out. A Prism Lotus and a Gnarled Vine. Nice. I think we still need Prism Lotuses too, don't we? Uh, we did need one more. That was it. Okay. What, how? Oh yeah, this room is hot. Okay, <laughs> so that that's helpful. Um... <laughs> What about the gnarled vine, though? Hmm. Uh, so we could plant the wood one next, I think. Probably plant it over here, although there's no spirit soil here. Hmm. Okay, well, we'll look at that next episode, too, I think. Divine Jade, okay. Not bad. Okay. Just noticed jade we can't store. It's kind of weird. So maybe we'll, we'll make sure that we keep less than a thousand of that. Um, yeah, okay. All right, well, yeah, I think that is a good good, good spot to call it. Uh, we'll probably look at, like I said, oh, wow, look at that, 161,000. So what's his maximum now? Woodshank. 220. Eh, that's not bad. He's still just a golden core, so he's going to be well over 300, I think. Uh, once he reaches the Creed of Azura. So, uh, we will uh, restructure our manual pavilion uh, and our entertainment chamber. Uh, we'll definitely widen it out at least a little bit more so we can get more, uh, more room in here. We can't actually have uh, too many more people in the sect anyway. So I think one more expansion of this uh, should be sufficient. So 
I hope you all enjoyed as always. Uh, hopefully we have other fun uh, stuff to do next episode. Uh, we still have a couple weeks until Liu and, and June are ready to, to break through. But uh, we'll keep uh, chugging along. So until next time, guys, peace.